It's one o'clock, <laughs> one hour and five minutes, and so far the green sticks held the fire in place. I was very curious about that. I think we still have way to go, and I wanted to uh, show the tools of the trade. What I used to build this fire was mainly the K-bar for the top layers and for the bottom layers my Laplander. I had a Laplander for I think it's a year and uh, I'm very pleased with it. <laughs> I had a, a Meyer saw before and that one didn't do <laughs> didn't do you can't even compare it to this one uh, you can see it had a rough amount of work done with it and I just love it I usually take it everywhere in my I don't use it every time but I take it and you can see the big chunks of wood it cut and with no effort if you want to cut green wood this is definitely the way to go. As for the K-bar, um, I'm learning to work with a big knife. The first time around, I was just um, well, having fun. But now, I'm really trying to learn more with it. And it, too, is fun. I'm trying, I put a lanyard on it. And it's not for, for my wrist. It's for my forearm. So you can... Uh, you can grab the knife by the blade and it has some support. Uh, let me, yeah, like this. It stays on your forearm and I've seen this in uh, Ron Hood's videos. And I've been playing around with this thing for, I don't know, two weeks. So far, works out really great. The lanyard does bother me when I chop because I don't actually put my wrist on it, through it when I chop. I go like this and sometimes it flies in front. And, but I'm coming to the theory that sometimes it's better to have just one big knife than two small knives. Okay, fire still going. Food is done and Coffee's on its way. Food was delicious. And I love the way you can uh, just lick a spoon and call it clean. <laughs> Never be outdoors. And uh, it's about coffee time. It's 1.20. So that's an hour and 25 minutes. We'll see how it goes from here. Still burning and the green sticks did their job and a few of them gave out just a couple of minutes ago <coughs> so far pleased very pleased it is now one hour and forty minutes since I've started the fire and still going. By the way, coffee's done. And it tastes great. Well, it's 1.50 and the last of the flames are dying out. So, I'm going to say I'm pretty happy. It all stayed in one place. I mean, didn't fall too far because so I built it really high. And well, about two hours. 
so I think it's good. The fire took um, about half an hour to build up, but it was pretty exhausting running around, getting the wood. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to call it quits now for the attending free because I'm going to collapse the green sticks also and pick up this big stick right here that's not burn burned all the way through and I'm going to put them on top so they can burn so I'll have uh, good ashes to so that will cool down and I can uh, clean it up properly. Yeah, about two hours. Two hours minus one minute. <laughs> but I still do have a flame. <laughs> well, you have a great day, and I hope uh, somebody can steal a bit of knowledge from this. I sure learned something. <laughs>